it, folks. It's uh, after midnight, and after doing a lot of testing with the uh, double setup, guy cam here, um, small wide field refractor, taking the images, um, and I finally get back in here. I finally got it uh, working pretty well. Uh, I didn't take the image I wanted to uh, due to some other issues, but uh, uh, you can see the guide camera here is still working away fine. Um, there's the graph down below showing the guiding that's going on right now. Um, and the image I'm taking is um, a section of the North American Nebula. It's upside down. This would be the United States, and this would actually be Mexico. And this part of uh, the nebula is actually called the Great Wall. Comes in very, very strong. Now, this is this is only um, in hydrogen alpha light. Um, to get um, a color image, I'd have, have to get out here on other nights now and take um, red, green, and blue images, combine them all together in a computer, and I'll come up with a nice color image. Uh, really, I'm surprised. Uh, the little camera's really working really, really well. And this hydrogen alpha light, we are, let's see, 17 minutes in, so that's 17 minutes of exposure. I'm taking one minute exposures and they're being stacked automatically, one over top of the other. Um, on and get uh, uh, oh, another five or ten minutes of data. I don't know. It's getting pretty late. I'm pretty beaten, tired, and uh, I'm sure everything's working, so I'm about to wrap up everything really tight. You know, I'll probably leave the cameras on the telescope and just wrap them up real good and uh, put the little housing back over them. And, uh, they'll be fine until the next night I can get out here and finish this little project. Um, it's coming out pretty good. Uh, not a bad image. So you are really getting some really nice, nice uh, dust detail in here along the wall and back up in here. You can see it, and of course, very, very strong hydrogen alpha light all through here. So uh, yeah, it's uh, come along pretty good. Um, so uh, check back with uh, me in the uh, next. And hopefully we'll get the uh, red, green, and blue data, and we can make a full color image out of it. Um, in fact, it probably would not hurt to uh, continue taking more hydrogen alpha light after I'm done with the red, green, and blue, and let it go for a couple of hours, and uh, really, really build up a really deep image. So, that's it for tonight, folks. Uh, we'll talk to you later.